Hi friends good to see you again all I hope you all will be fine. And for all of you I pray that God fulfill all your dreams and give you lots of happiness. And my dear friends every time I try my best to give you all latest news. Therefore, you are requested to sit tight on your seats and enjoy the latest news. Barack's stock exchange announced on Thursday that it traded more than 18 billion dinars, $13,734,000, in shares during its five sessions this week, marking the third trading week of October. Trading indicators showed that over 19 billion shares were exchanged during this week, amounting to more than 18 billion dinars in value. The ISX 60 index closed at 970.86 points in the first session of the week while it closed at 988.86 points at the end of the week, achieving a 2.80% increase compared to its first session close. The ISX 15 index closed at 1060.47 points in the first session of the week, while it closed at 1074.75 points at the end of the week, marking a 1.33% rise compared to its first session close. A total of 4,783 buy and sell contracts were executed on listed companies' shares during the week. And the Central Bank of Iraq, CBI, plays a crucial role in managing remittances and foreign currency transactions within the country. The remittance environment has seen notable advances and changes in recent times, which may be attributed to governmental actions and wider economic factors. Through its currency auction, the CBI claimed a 91% rise in overseas remittances in March 2024. The bank sold almost $213.4 million at this peak in a single auction, with the majority of the proceeds going for documentary credits and remittances. For documentary credits, the exchange rate was established at 1305 Iraqi dinars per US dollar, while for cash transactions, it was 1310 Iraqi dinars per US dollar. The efficacy of the CBI's monetary policies in stabilizing the Iraqi dinar and promoting foreign exchange flows is demonstrated by this growth. Additionally, the CBI has taken action to stop money laundering through the remittance network. The implementation of an electronic foreign remittance platform has been crucial in identifying genuine beneficiaries of transactions, thus reducing avenues for criminal operations, as stated by the CBI governor. Ali al Alak. This platform is part of a larger plan to improve international standards compliance and financial transparency. Some Iraqi banks have lowered their external remittance charges to 0.5% in order to improve the remittance process. This is in accordance with CBI regulations that seek to increase the accessibility of foreign currency services. It is anticipated that this decrease would motivate more people and companies to use official channels for their remittance requirements. The CBI's recent remittance measures are part of a larger attempt to expand access to financial services for all individuals, increase regulatory compliance, and stabilize the economy. Thanks take care.